children we will do a new poem the rum tum tugger written by t s eliot the rum tum tugger is a curious cat if you offer him pheasant he would rather have grouse if you put him in a house he would much prefer a flat if you put him in a flat then he would rather have a house if you set him on a mouse then he only wants a rat if you set him on a rat then he would rather chase a mouse Yes, the rum tum tugger is a curious cat, and there isn't any call for me to shout, shout it, for he will do as he do do, and there's no doing anything about it. The rum tum tugger is a terrible bore. When you let him in, then he wants to be out. He is always on the wrong side of every door, and as soon as he is at home, then he'd like to get about. He likes to lie in the bureau drawer. He, but he makes such a fuss if he can't get out. Yes, the rum tum tugger is a curious cat, and there isn't any use for you to doubt it, for he will do as he do do, and there's no doing up anything about it. The rum tum tugger is a curious beast. His disobliging ways are a matter of habit. If you offer him fish, then he always wants a feast. When there isn't any fish, then he won't eat rabbit. If you offer him cream, then he sniffs and sneers, for he only likes what he finds for him. So you will catch him it, catch him it, it, it right up to the ears. If you put him away on the radar shelf, the rum tum tugger is artful and knowing. The rum tum tugger doesn't care for a cuddle, but he leap on your lap in the middle of your swing. For there's nothing he enjoys like a horrible muddle. Yes, the rum tum tugger is a curious cat, and there's there isn't any need for me to spout it. For he will do as he do do, and there's no doing anything about it. Children, this is a very simple poem, and the cat is a curious cat which is always doing the opposite way. So enjoy the poem and memorize the first para.